before you can discover and manage DWL access points with the DWC controller. Take note of the following. The DWC controller sends L2 broadcast and L3 unicast discovery messages to find access points. L2 discovery is enabled by default on VLAN 1. L2 discovery of manageable DWL access points located in the same broadcast VLAN is enabled by default on the DWC controller. To enable L3 discovery of manageable DWL access points, navigate to the Wireless tab and then AP Poll List. Select IP Discovery tab and click on Add New IP Addresses to Poll, then specify the range of IP addresses to help the DWC controller discover the access points. Click the Refresh button on the top right to refresh it. Once an access point is found, you will find it listed in the Discovered AP list. To manage the access point, navigate to the Wireless tab and click Discovered AP list. Right-click on the entry and click on Manage. You can input information such as location and other details to help identify the access point in future. Click Save. You can now view the access point in the Managed APs list. Any access point in the Valid APs list will be automatically managed every time it is found by this wireless controller. To edit or delete the access point, right-click the entry and select the appropriate action. Once an access point is managed, its status will change to Managed in the Discovered AP list. You can also view all managed access points under the Managed APs tab. In the Discovered AP list, if the last status of an access point is authenticated, it means it is in the process of being managed. If the last status of an access point shows connection failed, it means it has been disconnected or powered off. If there is no database entry for the access point here, it means the access point's MAC address does not appear in the valid AP database.